Uh, what we're going to be doing today is you guys are going to be making shape castles and we're going to make a collage. So you'll need um, scissors, glue and some construction paper. So uh, just to start, uh, we talked to, uh, today in class about the artist Paul Clay. Paul Clay did um, paintings of castles using shapes. So all we're going to do, and look, this doesn't have to be perfect, but we're just going to use geometric shapes like rectangles and things like that. And we're going to start making our castle. So um, use whatever colors you want, um, but we're going to be making these castles using all these different geometric shapes, okay? Um, so I'm going to do like a little um, curved door here for the entrance. And I know it's a little blurry on my screen, so just bear with me. Um, but yeah, we're going to just keep on adding to these uh, and use lots of different colors. So maybe you want to have like some towers on the sides of your castle so we can draw or we can cut um, some castle towers to go up here. And then maybe, maybe each one has like a little um, window or something in there. So while you work, guys, just make sure that you're using geometric shapes like rectangles and ovals and things like that. And we can start to build up our castle uh, design. Okay. Um, Really quick, I want to show you guys a lot of castles. What makes it look like a castle is it'll have these um, ramparts up top or these. I like to just use squares or rectangles, so I'll just cut a bunch of them. Don't have to be perfect. And then um, just for time, I'm not going to glue these down, but I'm just going to show you. We can start to add them up top, and that's what's going to make it start to look like a castle. So uh, we're using the element of shape mainly here when we do this. And remember, shape is one of the seven elements of art, along with line, color, texture, form, value, space. So um, go ahead and add things and make it cool. Make it your own. Maybe yours has like a flag coming out the top or something like that. Um, but make sure that you're gluing down neatly. If you guys at home do not have any of these um, supplies, you can just do a drawn one instead. Yours does not have to be... Um, it does not have to be a collage, but us in school, we're going to make a collage. Okay. So I'm not going to glue it down for time, but that's basically, uh, where I want you guys to be headed. Okay. So have fun, uh, make it unique and make it your own. And I'll see you guys at the end of class.